guys and welcome back to another video um welcome to my channel if you're new welcome subscribe and don't miss a video what i basically do is i just put on makeup and just try and build myself confidence here on youtube okay so i need to stop saying so so i say so so many times you're just gonna have to get used to it right so ah I'm just gonna say so. So, ah. <laughs> okay, right. I can't say so without saying so. Right, what I, I thought, I can't say it. So, my aim today is to basically just do a summer video. As you can tell, I've got better lighting because I've got the curtains open, it's daytime, and I still have my lovely spotlight <laughs> pointing to moi. I thought, why not do a summer video where I just put kind of summer makeup. We're approaching summertime, which means less makeup, or at least to me, it means less makeup and try and look more natural. So that's what we are going to do. So I'm gonna start with applying a um, moisturizer. Uh, yeah, I do wash my face before I start putting makeup on. Only reason is I like feeling fresh when I, put, when I apply makeup on. That is the only reason. <laughs> Okay, so after applying moisturiser, I just go in with um, translucent powder. I just apply it. Bear in mind, guys, I am going to be talking a lot more today. Hopefully I am. Next step is applying setting spray. Okay, okie dokie. After applying the setting spray, I go on to, obviously, my trustworthy concealer. So my concealer is by my e.l.f. Blend, blend, blend. And obviously I'm gonna just try and achieve a uh, kind of settled look and not too much out there um obviously i like i love my last two looks where i put a lot of bronzer um but we can still do that um but just trying to keep that natural look because let's pretend we're on holiday and we're not and we're not on this horrible lockdown i hope you guys are keeping safe obviously and now we're going on to foundation okay sorry so my foundation is true match by l'oreal there you go um and my number is 25 that is the skin color that i try to match um yeah it is i feel i feel like it is the color of my skin but obviously when we're on holiday and we've got a lovely tan it's not going to be the our natural foundation obviously it might be a little bit darker which is okay girl because we all want that tan even i do even i want that tan even i want a tan i love a bit of a tan like don't you love it when like you go on a holiday and you come back and you still feel a lot like oh, you can feel it on your skin that tan But at the moment, our tan is literally being produced at our back garden. If we even have a back garden. If we don't have a back garden, it's not living room. Opening our windows and just kind of, yeah, going with the flow, getting the sun in. And um, yeah. Please let me know if you'd rather see me apply foundation or if you, if you just rather see kind of like the other bits of just not applying foundation and yeah, just doing the eyes and talking to you guys. So now I've applied the foundation. I'm gonna go into another finishing powder. So professional finishing powder, sleek. The one that I've just put is Sleek. And now I'm gonna go on to, um, but it's by Color, CEL Colors for Women. 
Sorry, it's a bit scratched. I cannot give you a reason up to why it is scratched. I don't know where I bought this because I didn't buy it. My nan gave it to me. Bless her. So, after applying foundation, finishing powder, translucent powder, and my powders, powder, 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 powder. I'm going to apply my setting spray again. Right, the only reason I'm applying so much setting spray is because I feel like it actually makes the makeup last longer. I am gonna go for a little walk later on with my partner, my little two children. I know it's just gonna be us for because of social distancing, but a girl has to look nice. And for a girl to look nice, okie dokie, eyebrows. And now let's go for filling them in. A good eyebrow shape. What was I doing? Eyes. So when applying the eyes, you need a brush for your concealer. Concealer is always sleek, as you know. I need to go and get new concealers, but one step at a time. We will go there, we will get there. Now we just have to work with what we have. Okay, like I said last time, I want to try the Chocolate Orange by Soph X. Um, I don't want to blind you guys, I don't want to see, I don't want you to see what I've got in front of me because it's absolutely messy. But I'm going to show you which palette I have. But it's very shiny, it's basically like a mirror. Which is nice, it's cute, but please excuse the mess. Right, so this is Soph X Extra Spice and I've been working with this for the past few videos. I haven't worked with all the colours, so I want to work with all the colours before I go and get another palette. That's the big T. But enough talking. I said I wanted to use chocolate orange, didn't I? No, I said I said I wanted to use cookie dough. Oh, right. So we're going to be using cookie dough, guys. So for you, the cookie dough basically is this one, and I want to use it because it looks simple, cute, and that's what that's the look we're trying to achieve, basically. Yeah. It's quite settled, to be honest. It's good. It's the look I actually normally go for. And yeah, I used to literally just look like this, guys. Even going out at night. This, bit of mascara, and we're good. That's why I wanna kind of build my self-confidence with makeup. And I want you guys to be in this journey with me. I wanna try new looks, I wanna try new brands, and I wanna try new tips that anyone might have for moi. Okay, like I said, simple look we're trying to achieve, so we're not trying to cake it off. Right. So I think we are good. Okay, so I think running late would actually look nice here as well. Mm. A bit of running late, and running late would be this one. Blend that in. A nice glittery eyeshadow just to kind of give that little spark. Oh my god, can be all right? Because we're going for a natural look, I think I might just go with dreams. And dreams is, is this. I don't know what I'm doing. But if it works, it works. There you go. Now it looks like we've got something. Mm. 
Yes. It's looking all right. It's looking all right. Now. So, concealer. I know this isn't our normal steps, but because we kind of done a boo-boo with our makeup, we're gonna improvise the makeup. And it's like what I said, I'm learning, you're learning, you might not be learning, you might just be watching the night and saying, yeah, you don't know what you're saying, you're doing, you don't know what you're saying, well, what are you doing? Like I said, I'm trying and I'm building my self-confidence up. So that's what I'm doing. Next step is not to do as many funny faces as I can. So many of you might be just be saying, girl, just get on with it. Stop talking, get on with it. I know. <clears throat> All right, with the eyes, I think we are good. We're not gonna add any more because it is a summer look and we're trying to, to keep it simple. Yeah. Bronzer. As always, sleek. Keep with a sleek. <clears throat> keep with a sneak and we will keep with you. What are you saying, girl? Is anyone else like this? Like, just talks utter rubbish. And then you're just kind of like, if anyone else hears me, I'll just sound like a crazy person. Blend it in. Highlighter, a bit of highlight, highlighter. Both my neighbours are in their gardens and they keep going to their shed and they can see a huge light and then I'm scared to put makeup on, you know, my window's closed with this heat. Are you crazy? Yes, I am. The sun literally just kind of like, it looks like it's just kissed the bridge of my nose and it's just gone like. And yeah. That lighting though. Okay, we're getting there. So, uh, um, the look is nearly done. All I need to do is apply mascara, maybe apply lashes on and see if I want to add a bit of lipstick or not. But our look is getting there, girls. We're getting there, guys. We're getting there. It's looking nice. I think I might add lashes, just kind of to give that glam look. like. <laughs> Girl, you can't mess with me. Right, so I've applied mascara. I've applied mascara to this eye. Now I'm just gonna apply eyelashes. Um, I'll come back once it's on, and we'll just talk a little bit about the look. And yeah. Okay, guys. So we are back, and with the finished look, please tell me what you think. I really enjoyed it. I really don't know what to say anymore because I had to redo this eyebrow. But to redo this eyelash because it, it kind of like looked like I had a wonky eye now it looks still look like a freaking look wonky eye it doesn't look good it's always something that's gonna go wrong right but this is the final look guys what do you think guys please please like subscribe share and comment down below what would you do what would you add what would you do and yes thank you for watching um i really enjoy doing these videos um i hope you like watching them as well as much as i like doing them um it has boosted my self-confidence a lot um uh yeah i'll see you next time bye